Good morning. I guess it's afternoon. Sorry. I forget that noon is hard for me because I forget to say afternoon. I still think it's morning time. Just want to make sure I'm in the right group and that I pull up the chat. Okay, so today I'm going to be doing my, let's zoom in a little. Let me see. It takes, it takes a second for Facebook to catch up. Okay, so we are going to be, today is Wacky Wednesday and we are doing this cute fun fold card. Okay. We're going to be using the Submarine Life Stamp Set and Punch. So I'm going to set the punch over there and put the stamp out of the way. So this is a, just a cute, fun fold card. I've done this card before, um, but it's one of my favorites. So let's grab my trimmer. So what you're going to need for this is a piece of... This is a, a quarter sheet or half a sheet of card stock. It's five and a... Five and a half by eight and a half. Okay, so we're gonna come in. I just don't want to tell you wrong, and I forgot to write my measurement down where I can find it. Okay, so we're gonna come in and we're gonna score at two and a half. Okay, and then we're gonna open this up all the way, and we're gonna score at six and three quarters. Okay, so there's that done. And put your trimmer away. I need my bone folder. Okay, so we're going to, I'm just burnishing my edges on the fold. And if you scored it correctly, you should have an even card front right like that. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is bring in our pieces and parts. So you are going to need a piece of four and a quarter by five and a, four by five and a quarter to go on the inside of our card. Like so, we're going to stamp on that though. And then you're going to need two pieces. This is from the 6x6 Suttles Designer Series paper. And this one measures one and a half by five and a quarter and two and a quarter by five and a quarter. The measurements are on my blog today if you want to, um, if you need them, if you want to recreate this card. And you can do, like, you don't have to do it as, with the Submarine Life. You can do this card with this fun fold with any paper any color um like i said this is one of the fun folds that i like to do it's quick it's easy and so there is that so you can see easy done done so these two pieces we're going to stamp on and this piece of scrap we're going to stamp on okay so let's go ahead and get started we're going to stamp start stamping sorry i'm going to start with this is from a basic white piece of paper and I cut it out with the postage dies. Um, hold on, I'll show them to you. I just had them right here. So it, um, these are the postage dies. And so I just took one of the bigger ones and cut it out. Okay, so now we're gonna bring in our Lost Lagoon ink. I'm gonna scoot this up just a little bit. So the first thing I'm going to stamp is this is the seaweed and I just want the tops of it along the bottom. So I'm just, this is a different seaweed, but it's fine. It'll work. Let me see. I grabbed the wrong one, but that's okay. I'm just going to switch it out really quick. Okay. So we're just going to, I'm just going to turn this over. And we'll start again. So I'm just stamping the tops. Some will be taller, some will be shorter. I just want it along the bottom, like so. Okay. Then I'm gonna bring in my this is like the wave, and if all these stamps come in the stamp set, but this is like the wave, and I just want it to go across the top. It doesn't reach, so you have to re-ink and stamp. And you could do this. Mine's crooked, but I'm okay with that. Um, and then I'm going to stamp my happy birthday. 
on all this we're stamping in Lost Lagoon and then we have the bubbles and I just come in and stamp them all over here so that just like that okay so I'm gonna set this to the side we're gonna bring in our scrap paper and our daffodil delight ink okay and I'm gonna stamp my submarine in daffodil delight just like that and then I'm gonna close this just because I'm afraid I'll end up in it and then I'm going to stamp punch that out okay so there's our piece we're gonna punch out and then I need a piece of daffodil delight scrap okay and I'm going to punch out the other two pieces using that. Okay. So now let's see the inside. So on the inside, we need our little crab and we need our dirt, sand, whatever you want to call it. So this for the sand, I used crumb cake. Okay, so I'm going to ink up my sand, we're going to start in the corner and we're only going to do sand as far as that the stamp goes. And then I'm going to use real red for my crab, okay, and we're just going to put him on top of this hill like that, okay. So all the stamping is done. So now we're gonna bring our card back in. This is our insert on the inside where we're gonna put our message. When we write a message, just like so. And then this is gonna, I'm gonna attach this next. And I just want adhesive on the top portion, okay? Because the bottom portion, you want it to be free to open up like that okay so we're gonna bring in our adhesive and put down our um, submarine okay and this goes like that and then I need the little color you can use liquid glue to put these on if you want I just prefer to use once I have the heat one adhesive out I just try to use it as much as I can okay so this is our fun fold card for today quick simple easy thanks Donna I'm glad you were able to join me it's a quick easy fun fold and you don't like I said you could use this with any of our bundles or any of our stamp sets it just the, the card can be recreated as many times as you want but uh, measurements are all on my blog stampwithroberta.com if you have any questions, please let me know and I will gladly come back and answer any questions. And I thank you for joining me today.